Yo, what up everybody? Welcome back once again to the Big O Show. If this is your first time here, do me a huge favor, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date on all future content here on the channel. Please help your boy get to 70 subscribers before 2022 walks in. Did I say that right? 2022. Yeah, before the year 2022. I'm at 66 right now. I'm trying to get to 70 to help your boy get four more subscribers so we can knock this out the park. So, with that out the way, uh, let's get to the main topic of this video, which is Dwayne The Rock Johnson basically coming out and saying that he will not be coming back for, uh, you know, the Fast and the Furious franchise. Um, basically, some news came out today, earlier today, uh, Dwayne Johnson said that um, he spoke with Vin Diesel months ago, and he told Vin Diesel that he was not coming back to the Fast and the Furious franchise. He said he spoke with him, I believe, back in June. He talked to him face to face, not to social media, and you know they had a conversation man to man. And he basically got his point across, where he said he was not coming back to the Fast and the Furious franchise. Fast forward to I believe either September or October, Vin Diesel made a public, uh, let me say, plea to Dwayne the Rock Johnson, where he asked Dwayne the Rock Johnson to come back to the franchise to fulfill his destiny. <clears throat> Excuse me. And, you know, he brought in uh, Paul Walker and he talked about uh, his own kids, about how much they love um, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. So, fast forward to recently as of today, the Rock, Dwayne The Rock Johnson wasn't happy to hear about, uh, you know, Vin Diesel using Pablo, a.k.a. Paul Walker, and also um, his own kids to try to, in his words, manipulate him to come back to the franchise. And, uh, you know, he basically like, look, man, in so many words, I'm done. You know, I gave everything I could to the franchise. You know, y'all got to finish it off, finish strong, all that good stuff. And just to give my one-two on it, um, I'm not really, what's the word? What's the word I'm looking for? I'm not disappointed, too disappointed if he doesn't come back. If he's really done, I'm going to say maybe 80% of me is not disappointed. Because, honestly, I think they should have stopped the franchise after Fast 7. After Paul Walker's send-off, that's where I think they should have stopped the franchise at. When they uh, did Fast 8, I thought it was kind of eh. When they did Fast 9, I thought it was a little bit better than Fast. Let me see, maybe that much better than Fast um, 8, but I didn't think it was that much better. I thought it was okay. But it did feel like something was missing. Of course, these movies missed Paul Walker. And, of course, Dwayne Johnson, a.k.a. Hobbs' character was missing from these movies. And, um, you know, it sucks if he doesn't come back. You know, it, that, it's the 80% right there that I'm saying that doesn't feel bad if he doesn't come back. Because at the end of the day, there's not a whole lot that he can really bring to the franchise. Even if he would have been in Fast 9, I don't think there's much his Hobbs' character would have, uh, would have you know, gave the movie any more juice. Um, fast forward from that. It's that little 20% that wants to see him come back because his character is so cool and I really like his Hobbs character, especially in Fast Five, I think. It was Fast Five. That's still my favorite Fast movie to date. Fast Five is definitely the one where he, um, you know, where that character just became the shit and it's been the shit ever since. And honestly, if he, you know, I would like to see him come back just because I like his Hobbs character, but again, if he doesn't, I'm not disappointed. I'm cool with it. So, you know, that's pretty much all I got for this video. And let me know in the comment section, what do y'all think? Do y'all think his character is officially done? Do you think he should come, do you think he should come back? Um, if not, you know, why? Let me know in the comment section below. Until next time, I'm Big O, and this is Big O Show. Peace. I'll see y'all in 2022.